If you'd asked me, do I want to see Artie Ziff returning in an episode of The Simpsons, I would have said, not really, no. However, Half Decent Proposal is a really good episode and one that I, I definitely enjoyed. This is in the 13th season, it's the 10th episode, it's directed by Jim Reardon and Lauren McMullen and it's got 7.3 out of 10 on IMDb, which for this point is a pretty pretty average, pretty good rating for The Simpsons. And it starts off with a problem that Marge has, she cannot sleep because Homer is snoring. And if you've ever lived with anybody who snores horrendously, I'm sure you'll be able to understand her feelings. And... She stays over at Patty and Selma's to try and get at least one night of sleep. And while there, they learn that Artie Ziff, her former boyfriend, who has appeared in a previous episode, is one of the, you know, he's on a richest people list. And Patty and Selma encourage her, while she's drinking, to send him an email. And Artie goes to visit Marge in his helicopter and proposes that he would pay Homer a million dollars to allow Artie to have one weekend with Marge. And it's not necessarily a sexual thing, just to spend time with her. And it kind of made me think, yeah, no, I'd go for that. Especially if it's not a physical thing and you're just spending time with them. Then, you know, there, there, I can't imagine there's anybody I would not spend a weekend with if I got a million pounds out of it as a result. I really don't think there is. But obviously not everything is as straightforward. Marge is obviously not willing to do this. But Homer points out, if you do this, we could afford that surgery I need for my snoring. And I won't say what happens after that or if she goes through with it or if they find other resolutions or anything. But I, I quite liked it. I liked to hate Artie. When we've met him previously, I just kind of... I didn't care about the character. I could take him, I could leave him. But in this episode, I think he was suitably annoying um i will say marge at, at one point calls him a nerd as an insult and i thought ouch that's that's a bit unnecessary there's nothing wrong with being a nerd but generally i feel like it's a very well written character with a very annoying but enjoyable personality i think the development of the narrative was really unpredictable at certain parts um lenny has a role in this and i have to say that is so sweet I obviously won't spoil exactly what his role is, but whenever Lenny was in it, I thought he added a lot of value to the episode. It is quite thought-provoking uh, in the sense that I thought, would I do this? And very quickly, I kind of went, yes, if somebody offered me or my household a million pounds to spend a non-sexual weekend with literally anybody, I really can't think of anybody I wouldn't spend that time with for that much money. I don't know if that's... Uh, I, I hope everybody else would feel the same, otherwise that says a lot about me. But I enjoyed the episode. It's definitely not my favourite. It's not one of my all-time favourite episodes. Uh, I feel like there wasn't enough Bart and Lisa in it. That's not to say every episode has to be full of Bart and Lisa, but I just I really like the characters. Um, so for me personally, I'd like to have seen them a bit more, but that, that's not a flaw in the episode. I liked it. Definitely not a favourite. Not even a favourite from season 13. But I certainly did enjoy it.